morning world we're all hooked up and ready to go check out another marketplace find You know, 2000K, 2500. She's uh, a little roached out. Let's sit for a bit. I think uh, some rodents might have made it their home for a little while. But overall, I think we can make a pretty nice truck out of it. Dang, windows were left open for like four years. She's uh, moldy inside. She might have some electrical issues. They are kind enough to give us some goodies. This one would be good. She'll hold some there. Maybe we'll get a burnout or two out of them. I think the forklift driver rammed right into her. Might have been a bush latte drinker. Had one too many, took it apart and forgot how to put it back together. But she had brand new tires on her. Clean up the battery terminals and throw a battery in, see if she catches on fire. Hopefully not. Well, I cleaned up the terminals, put a battery in it, but I think I'm going to try to uh, just blow some of this crap off the engine before we try to, yummy, start it. We'll see how it goes. Well, here goes nothing. Let's give it some power. See if any of these uh, shoot up wires. Ooh, I hear a noise. See no fire. The battery's not good. Probably a dead battery, no one our luck. Usually we put three or four in before we get the right one. The right one's the one out of the daily driver. See what happens. Oh, I hear a fuel pump. Radio's kicked on. Security, that's never good. Oh, what the hell? She's going to start right up. Get out of here. That's going to be way too easy. It's like the keys up with that. I'm surprised she didn't start right up. So much for a will it start video. Oh, yeah, ladybugs. This is out the older weak fuel pump.
I can't believe she's trying to run. Use security. <laughs> Crazy. Well, she started up. I don't know if we should try to figure out uh, where this computer goes. I'm guessing maybe somewhere there. And hook one of them up just in case it starts. Maybe we can put it in gear. I'm pretty surprised it actually fired up. I mean, look, it came with plant life. Free. Put that in pot, bring it in the house for the wifey. Some brownie points. She won't be so uh, mad that we bought another project. No, I'm just playing. Wifey's awesome. Oh, I got uh, redneck Cosby sauce. Little pinhole in the top. There's some extra added fuel. See if anything happens. Okay, I lied. We're not gonna. We're gonna just give her some fuel. Let's hear her run. Then we'll figure out where the computers go. Ooh. I don't know, it could be because that computer's not in. Maybe that's why the security light's flashing. And we're just playing a game. Start for two seconds. Yeah, I think that might be it. Just playing. Fellas, <laughs> with Valentine's Day coming up, make sure you get your old lady something special. <laughs> Luckily for us, we got a free one. Don't be cheap. You know, pick in my space. Oh, you gotta get her out of here without killing her. I don't want the spider. She might get mad at us. That's how you get a happy wife. Well, fellas, would you look at that? Five minutes of my time and a little bit of my mind and came up with a nice little free gift for the wifey. Also multi-purpose. A little bit of chalk. She got a little sweet note. I can leave uh, more notes for her throughout the year. Pretty cute, huh? Fellers, a little word of advice. Make sure you trick, I mean pick a good woman in life. One that supports you and helps you out as much as she can. My wonderful wife who decides she was going to clean the truck for me. Well, we didn't get a whole lot of goodies. Garbage can uh, literally filled right up to the brim. Bunch of bald junk rims. Mismatched too. Five lug. It's going to fit an eight lug real well. Bunch of nails. An outlet. A camera. I'm a little afraid to see what's on that. Some carpet cleaner, hopefully that works. Saves a four bucks or something. Dead battery, core charge. I really don't think these computers that they gave me even go to this truck. I think they're for the model before it. Ugly toolbox, that's not going back in there. Three beauty rooms. Rings, oh my bad. But inside didn't clean up too bad for being vacuumed. Amazing wife. She did pretty decent in here. Still needs a scrub and we gotta wipe her down. Dash cracked the shit. Still all moldy and nasty. We'll get there. But for a quick vacuum. 
back seat's pretty nice. Nasty door panels. And the bed was absolutely disgusting. Real scaly, but hey, if we uh, use some kind of bed coating on it, it's just added texture. Think we're gonna have to rip the whole carpet out. We'll see. Free can of carpet clean works. Upholstery clean, everything clean. This thing's never ending. Oh, oh, oh. See, they're getting lower. No, she's just going. Just keeps going and going and going. Hope they get your money worth, especially when it's free. And when you think it's dead, it starts working good again.
She's trying to run. I reset the security system. I should have recorded. My bad. But that was progress. I'm not going to lie. I played with the security system. Resetting the whatever it is. Doing the key cycle thing. 30 freaking times. Uh, boom, she finally fired up. She don't sound too good, but she's running. Well, she's running pretty good. The longer she runs, the better she sounds. I'm going to check the training fluid in a minute. This transmission is literally brand new. I have the receipt for it. They had it all rebuilt. Cost $2,200. And uh, they put brand new tires on it, and then I guess the truck got parked because of an electrical issue. I got a hold of the lady and talked to her a little bit about it. She cleaned up pretty good the other day. All we really did is washed her down with a pressure washer, and the wifey vacuumed her out. We still got a scrub. She smells, man. She smells like a burning rat's nest. This thing still has the catalytic converters on it. Yeah, I was amazed too. I couldn't believe it. You look at this old girl. 306,000 miles. Oh, she purring like a kitten. Oh, don't, oh, don't, 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 oh, keep going. You got, oh, yeah, you see? She just needs to run. It's got that high octane gas from four years ago. A little bit of less freaking water they put in it. She don't like that. The wiring is an absolute mess, guys. I cut a bunch of it out. There was a rat's nest under the dash. everywhere the tranny wires are about the same shape but hey she's running let's leave this rag here Bungee brakes. She's running on about three cylinders. Something. Look at the rat's nest falling out. Oh, she runs, she drives. She's still got oil pressure. She's not overheating. Speedometer don't work. So how many miles do you think it really has on it? <laughs> Oh, I think there's a rat's nest on fire, guys. Oh, it fucking stinks. We pulled her back in the shop. I'm gonna check tire pressure and uh, stuff like that. She's still running, not overheating. Still has good oil pressure. Look at that door panel. That thing cleaned up pretty good for just being pressure washed. Put some comment or something on it, scrub the crap out of it, made it look better. I checked the training fluid like, I don't know, five, six minutes ago, and it just seemed like it was pretty high. Yeah, look at 
drain some out. Check the tire pressure and I don't know, maybe take it for a little pup pup ride around the field again. I think it'll start up if we shut it off. I'm scared to shut her off. Okay, here we go. Start back up, please, please, please. Oh yeah, no doubt. It's a Chevy. It's going to start every time. Skips when it starts. Skipping. She's not skipping. Guys, it's cold this morning in Florida. I don't know if you can see this or not, but <sighs> oh, that's my breath. Well, let's see if she'll start up today. I don't think we're gonna try to do a burnout with this. I don't want to drop a bunch of money into it to give it a tune up and make it stop skipping. Really, I'd like to engine swap this thing. Put a diesel in it or something. I'm not sure. Pop your ideals down there in the comments. Let me know what you'd want to do to it. Like a Deramax sounds pretty cool to me. I don't know if she'll start. Let's see. Woohoo! No shit. Maybe we'll try. I don't know. Running way better than yesterday. She leaks some freaking oil, man. Just spurts out the oil pan. The front seal. Aw, oh, poor girl. She cold, too. Well, if you liked the video, please hit like and subscribe. Thank you, everyone. Appreciate you watching. Busted a coolant line. But don't worry. We're just going to cut it off. We'll cut the hose down here somewhere. Put a clamp on her and she'll be like good as new. Built us a burnout pad.
See, we knew it would do it. She just needed a little help. That's pretty sweet. I guess the tires ain't brand new anymore. Nice. We ain't even got to build one anymore. That's awesome.